Patrick Coleman finished third here tonight. Man, look, your team car, you, you get a substitute driver in the other car, he pulls it up, what's the deal with it? He pulled my ass, nah. <laughs> he got me on the restart and I was catching on the end, but I just ran out of brakes and was pushed to the center and loose off, but I didn't care, man. Uh, second, third is good enough for me to wait the last couple weeks and then uh, tearing stuff up every week, so uh, good for this. Uh, Shane's story on TV last night helped me out a little bit, so. You know, uh, can't wait to come back. Uh, we'll catch the 44 one of these days, I hope. Yeah, you, you had Rodney Cook's crew work on your car with us. Helped out a whole lot, hasn't he? Yeah, uh, you know, uh, you gotta, I guess you gotta watch it. You got work on your car around here days because uh, they take air filters. I guess a big gain or something, but it's all good. Uh, we'll come back next time, run them like hell, give them all I got. Uh, I don't ever let off, man, 110% all the way. And, you know, that's, that's how it is from here on out. And, uh, glad to see that 50 in the pits tonight. Jason Payne finished second here in the big limited race. First of all, man, what, what, what are you doing here? You've been out for a while on late models and you're in Patrick Coleman's other limited car. Well, I, you know, we had a wreck fest here for a while and every week, four weeks in a row, my car got tore up, tore up, tore up. Didn't take long to take the money out of my pocket. You know? I mean, you run a budget. Some of us don't have funds like the others. We got a good car. We just got to put a body and, you know, front end back on it and radiator and all. But, uh, hey, I was down and called Larry and, Larry, let me lease this car to come run. Hey, we had 20 laps on it last night. That's it. Come over here, race, run second. That ain't bad. We'll go home, do a little work. Maybe he'll put me back in the seat and we'll come back. Here with Dylan Bass. Just picked up the big win here tonight, man. I don't know. This is eight wins for the road. Are you about tired of it yet? Well, first of all, I want to thank Chris. It's his birthday. I want to say happy birthday to him. Uh, I was trying to win this for him more than the money or anything. But it feels good to collect the first bounty and, uh, Hopefully we can collect the rest of them, but it ain't going to be easy, but I'd like to thank mom and dad. That's the single skirt, uh, roof shampoo, all our racing chassis, LP gears, they help us a lot, they fix our shift, and uh, carry on the calls, bless the paint shocks, all these guys. Yeah, well, now you're starting in the back, to make you start in the back, is it teaching you a lot more patience now like, to race coming up to the field? Well, last week uh, I didn't listen to my dad. And uh, he was right, uh, kind of wrecked on the first lap, first corner. But this uh, this week, I listened to him. He's smart, uh, even though I might not think that sometimes. But it's, he knows what he's talking about 99% of the time. I just want to thank him for all he's done for me and uh, my mom for paying the bills. And you picked up the $500. You picked up the bounty on yourself. I don't know if there's anything left here, is there? I don't know. We'll find out next week.